Hi everyone, here's a video with a hint for how to do the second part of this investigation. So, this is the triangle that you've been given and the goal is you want to work out the interior angles here, here and here. So the first thing you're going to have to do is to make this question look similar to an earlier question. So the ones with triangles where there's a point in the middle. So the way I'm going to do this, let me just, yep, is to draw a line from the centre out to the vertex of the triangle, like so. And now if I compare this triangle section here, I'll notice that it's the same shape as one of the triangles we did earlier. It's got a point in the middle, it goes through two sections of the circle, so I can write down what the angles are. So let me just quickly look back at what we wrote earlier on. Um, oops. So we said, here we go, that one, right? So you've got 80 degrees in the middle and then 50 and 50 because this triangle is the shape that we looked at before. So, sorry, let me just find my, <laughs> there. Right, so that's gonna be 80 in here, and then that'll be 50, and then that'll be 50. Now look for this triangle. Let me turn on the pen. So we said that was 80. Whoops. Let's make that a bit thinner. And then this bit was 50 and that bit was 50. So just in that first triangle, that, this is the first triangle. Here's the second triangle. Right? We said uh, earlier we worked out that if you've got this shaped triangle, the middle angle part is going to be 120 and then the two base angles would be um, 30 and 30. So now we know that this whole angle here is going to be 80 degrees. There it is. Here's the last one. Um, I can work out that in the middle this is going to be 160 degrees. Because right? it goes through four sections of the circle. Right? One, two, three, four. goes around uh, four slices. And we knew each of the slices had a centre angle of 40 degrees. So four times 40, 160. And then the last two, this one here is therefore going to be 10, and that will be 10. So we could we work that out earlier. Now I've got all three uh, vertices of the pink triangle. Right? That one's 40, and that one is um, 60. Yes, yeah, just double check. Three angles add up to 180 degrees. Right, done. Now the last part is always, do you notice anything? Is there anything you notice? So I'm just going to give you some... Uh, some hints. Have a look at, uh, look at one of the center angles, right, so let's say there's 160, and now compare that to the three interior angles of the triangle. Does, that, does anything stand out? Right, so you've got three exterior, ang sorry, interior angles, and then look at the 160 there. If you've had a look at that, what else could you do? You could um, have a look at the other interior angle. So let's look at the hmm, let's look at the 80. Right? Look at the 80 degrees, look at the three corner angles that you've got there. Do you notice anything? And then try it with, again with the third one, look at the 120. Do you notice anything compared to the three angles at the corner? Okay, so that's something for you to have a think about. If you're still stuck, leave me a comment um, or message me and I might make a solutions or, or I'll type the solutions up for tomorrow. Okay, have a nice day. Bye.